Hey guys, it's Bryant with I Have Comic Issues, and today I'm going to bring you or show you my uh, latest uh, comic book haul from my local LCS. I um, did a few, uh, I looked into the bargain bins or the dollar bins, got a few there, got a couple of new releases. And then I had a little bit of a, I saw something there the other day had a little bit of a crisis about it and I decided to pull the trigger when I went back today and I uh, picked them up and I'll show you what I'm talking about towards the end of the video. So the first things first, let's, uh, please like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think of the videos that I've been doing so far, uh, this video, let me know what you think of the books that I'm showing you. Um, yeah and thank you uh, please check me out also on uh, instagram um, it's uh, i have comic issues uh, so check me out there follow let me see what you're collecting and things like that i'll try to show you uh, what i'm collecting the uh, on instagram also besides what i'm showing you in the videos all right so first things first i got two copies of devil's reign omega uh, Pretty cool. They were both a dollar. They looked in really good condition. So, you got two copies of those. Next one I got is Doctor Strange Nexus of Nightmares. Uh, this number one, I believe this is the uh, cover A variant. So, that's pretty cool. Next one that I got for a dollar is Demon Days Blood Feud. Uh, it's a story by, uh, I think it's uh, Peach Mimoku. Uh, this is a different variant uh, uh, cover. I'll try to uh, get the artist's name and put them down in the description, or not description, but down in the bottom of the video here so you can see who the artist was. All right. Next one that I got for a dollar is uh, Ghost Rider number 50. It's a die cut uh, foil cover. Picked it up for a dollar. I didn't realize it until just a little bit ago. The reason why it was in the dollar bin is because right here uh, on the die cut part, there is a uh, fold or it got bent. So. I don't know if you can see the crease right there, but that's about the only defect that I can see on this one. And then I picked up Maestro number two, War and Pax. Uh, got, yeah, this one for a dollar. Really uh, clean looking copy there. I also picked up uh, Maestro number five, and this is from the uh, series before the War and Pax. But yeah, Maestro number five looks pretty good. And then these are some that I got off of the uh, off of the new uh, comics uh, wall, but they, they've been out for a couple months, but they weren't in the back issues yet. I think it's a really cool looking cover and story, but I got a couple of copies of Berserker number one, uh, the Keanu Reeves uh, comic book that he's helping out on. Uh, this is the regular cover A. Um, I also picked up the foil, a uh, uh, variant of the cover A, and that one's really sharp. And then I picked up a different uh, cover A, or not, a different foil uh, cover of Berserker 1. Um, I'll try to uh, put who the artist is right down here. All right. Okay. And the last ones that I'm going to show you are the ones that I had a crisis about. And 
I've seen this uh, limited series before, did not see it when it came out originally, uh, but I thought it'd be, I have picked up on it a little bit uh, over the last uh, couple of years, especially since it was a storyline that was implemented into one of the uh, CW uh, Arrowverse TV shows. And we're talking about I picked up the entire run of Crisis on Infinite Earths uh, from 1985. And these, all of them are in the newsstand and they look very, very clean. Uh, so yeah, and I got, I think I got a really good deal. I got the whole 12 run set for $65. So I think that's pretty good. Uh, so, yeah, got issue number one, newsstand. Issue number two in the newsstand. Issue number three in the newsstand. Four, newsstand. Issue five in the newsstand. Issue six in the newsstand. Issue seven, the iconic cover here uh, in the newsstand. Issue number eight, the death of Barry Allen, the Flash in newsstand. Okay. Issue number nine in the newsstand. Issue 10 in the newsstand. Issue 11 in the newsstand also. And issue number 12 in the newsstand. Really, like I said, really happy about this. Got all 12. Didn't real, I was gonna buy it anyways today. Didn't real, know that they're all newsstand until I got home and opened it up, but that was really good. Really happy about that. So um, those are the books that I got at my, uh, local LCS. Uh, hope you like them. Hope that you like them. Uh, please let me know what you think. Please uh, like, uh, comment, subscribe, help the uh, al algorithm uh, so we can sh so other people can see this video also. Um, and check me out on Instagram. Um, hit me up, let me know what you think, and let me know what you think I should look for. All right. Thank you very much. And once again, this is Bryant with I Have Comic Issues.